This is a Scrum Sports Quick Fix on Radio Influence. Mike Evans realized, all right, I'm, I, I, I got people know how I feel now. And I think that even though he said Sunday he plans to sit through as long as Trump's the president, he plans to sit. I think whether it was somebody in his ear, whether it was him waking up one morning and realizing eh, it probably wasn't the smartest thing in the world, um, you know, there are going to be people that say, whoa, look, at you, you sold out, you sold out. Mike Evans didn't sell out. He still even says in here, he still feels that way. He's not going against how he feels. He's just, he's got his, he got his expression out there. Now he's saying, people now know how I feel. I'm going to start standing with my teammates now. You would have been better off just saying something to the media. In a saying, press conference. In a yes. press conference saying, hey, I, I don't like Donald Trump. I disagree with the fact that he's been voted our president-elect. I don't like it at all. But I, I just disagree with the symbolic gesture of sitting during the end. All right, let's do a little role play here for a second. Oh we boy. rarely ever do this. Let's do a little role play. Oh, boy. You're Mike Evans standing at the podium. Talk for a brief second about your disagreement with Donald Trump. Go for it. Well, I got to say that um, I disagree in the fact that we've elected a, a reality TV star, this celebrity guy that has no political experience at all to be our next commander in chief. Uh, can, can I ask you a question, Mike? Go ahead. Uh, Mike, did you actually take the time on Tuesday or earlier before voting uh, officially opened on Tuesday to actually go out and voice your opinion in the voters booth uh, for either Trump, uh, Hillary Clinton, or uh, Johnson. I actually chose not to vote because I believe that this voting system that we have is very corrupt. It's it doesn't really solve anything. When when it boils down to it, all we had were lousy candidates across the board. And if I didn't think any of them were going to make a difference, then you know what? Why even bother if none of them are going to really? You know, make you know, change things in this country for the better. One quick follow up, Mike. So you say that, but how can you sit in protest of, of President Trump without voting? If you didn't feel strong enough to make your voice heard, that's my right. That's my right as an American. I, I can express my opinion however I want, and I feel like that that's that's the best way to do it is for me to just get that out there. It's my right to to express how I feel, yeah. and if I don't. Want to vote? It's my choice whether or not I, I want to vote. And you know what? I think that um, I think that had he taken that route, that's the way it probably would have gone, and we might not be talking about it like we are today. It would have been just a blip on the radar. The Scrum Sports Show can be found on iTunes, Stitcher, and RadioInfluence.com.